All right, guys, this is the bridal bowling of firevids.com corkscrew lower. I'm Nick Hawks, and I'm going to try to explain this to you. This is what the knot looks like. Uh, in the firevids.com video, it was done extremely fast and a bad angle, so I hope I can get this done for you. Check it out. In, in, put our slack, slack, in, in, put our slack, grab our standing in, over, flip, makes our half hitch, the standing in is on the bottom, working in with the top, so then we're going to run and, and up through it, reach down, bring this over top, on top of our half hitch, and then finish off the standard bolt. Then I'm back through the loop, hold on to this and this, snap it shut, and adjust if necessary. And of course, always, Always finish them up with the safety. Always finish them up with the safety. Right. Adjust it. Pull that safety up into a little bit if you'd like. Press it down. And adjust the way you please. And you want to leave enough slack to come down. Alright, so that's the video. So what we're going to do here, now we're going to make our half hitch, bring it back over top. And now we're going to bring the end of our rope up through the bottom of the loop. Make sure that it comes through the bottom. It will not hold if it is not through the bottom. It has to come through the bottom. Just let it hang out there, that's fine. Right now we're going to bring the side closest to you that's on the ground in front of you. It's on the side of the basket. You can bring that over and it's going to go on top of the top part of our half hitch. It has to be on top. That's crucial. It will flip on you if not. All right. Then we're going to finish off with a standard bowling around the back, back down through the hole. And you're just going to dress it up from there. Always safety and not. Every time, always safety or not, doesn't matter how good you are or are not at it, always safety or not, you can dress it up, it looks fine, and that will keep that knot from flipping, sliding around, and as you can see, it's locked in on each end of the basket. Alright, I'm going to show you guys the video one more time. This is for the attendant 8 here, this picture. Alright, and like I said, this is originally intended for a rapid extrication of a down firefighter or another victim, so the attendant 8, really not going to need that. Right here, standing in, over, flip, makes our half hitch. The standing in is on the bottom, working in with the top. So then we're going to run in and up through it. Reach down, bring this over top, on top of our half hitch, and then finish off standard bolt. Then I'm back through the loop, hold on to this and this, snap and shut, and adjust if necessary. And of course, always, and I repeat, always finish them up with the safety. Always finish them up with the safety. Right. You can adjust that. Pull that safety up into it a little bit if you'd like. Press it down. Just any way you please.